In this video, we're going to talk about how to get balls out of the front ball return if they're stuck. Indicator that balls are stuck in the front ball return is that balls aren't coming back up from the back. And when that happens, you want to resolve the issue as quickly as possible or else it could cause strain on the ball return belt and cause the belt to break. So to begin, you're going to come to the breaker box so you can turn the machine off for safety purposes. So you're going to look at the sheet inside that tells you which switch goes to which ball return or what function the switch is. So we are going to do ball return 9 and 10, which is right here. So we're going to locate the right switch and flip it. Before you come out to the alley to get the balls out of the bottom of the ball return, you're going to want to grab either a screwdriver or a pen to lift up the floorboard. So to remove the floorboard slash trap door, you're going to take the screwdriver and place it here and pull upwards on the floorboard. And it will slide outward. And as you can see, we have a ball stuck in there, as well as there are a couple up front. Once you get the trap door open, you're going to reach in and grab whichever balls you can out of the trap door. So you're going to grab as many of them as you can. So since there was a ball far out of my reach from trying to reach through the trap door, we're going to take off the plastic cover and you're going to reach in and push the ball outwards. In this case, the bowling balls were stuck further up on the ball return, but if they're stuck further down under the approach, you can't remove any of the paneling there. So you're going to want to take the bumper stick and fish for them out. If the ball is stuck further down on the lanes, you are going to want to remove the gutter capping so that you can take the ball out. You can remove the gutter capping by pulling up on each side of the panel.